Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. Customer states they hear a ticking noise after they topped up the engine with oil. This customer's vehicle was towed in as a drive shaft off a semi flew off and went through the fuel tank. And this customer brought in their vehicle as they have a fluid leak and soft brake pedal after they tried changing the oil on the car themselves. The mechanic found that the customer had loosened the brake accumulator as he thought it was the engine oil filter. When this customer brought in their Mercedes-Benz for an oil change, the technician noticed multiple engine mounts were broken. The customer declined repairs. This Porsche was towed in as the customer said the brakes seized after he replaced the brakes himself and bled the system. The technician found out that the customer had filled the brake and clutch fluid reservoir with gear oil. Customer states battery drains overnight. The technician heard a beeping noise so he looked in the trunk and saw this custom sound system set up using home stereo speakers and some sort of amp that was put into a cardboard box that was used for some frozen pizzas. The technician disconnected the sound system and some extension cords and it fixed the customer's concern. This customer brought in their vehicle as they said washer fluid is slow to come out. The technician found out that the customer had put dish soap in the reservoir, which caused low pressure as a washer pump was aerated in the dish soap. So the technician disconnected a line to drain out all of the soap. When this customer brought in their Audi for a check engine light, the technician discovered that the customer had connected their airbox water drain directly to the crankcase vent. And this customer brought in their vehicle as they said they still have a power steering leak after they changed the pump and they think they now have a line that's leaking. The technician found that the customer had damaged the pump and seal that goes behind the pulley when he installed it. The viewer who shared this clip said the customer had an engine misfire and still tried to drive their vehicle to the shop. When this customer brought in their car for an exhaust related concern, the mechanic was pretty surprised to see this when he opened the hood and said he's not quite sure what this exactly was. And this customer brought in their Jeep as they said they have a vibration after her grandson installed new rear brake pads. The technician found that the lug nuts were left loose and the customer just made it on time to the shop. This customer's vehicle was brought in as they said the shop left the lower engine cover loose and it fell down. The technician found that a piece of pizza somehow hit it and ripped it loose. So we're doing an oil change. I've seen people bring their dogs in, their cats in. This one's a first. Baby goat wearing a diaper. Customer states he replaced his own oil pan, but it still leaks. Here's a tip on how to remove stuck ignition coil boots. And just a reminder, you can submit clips that you personally filmed on our website at justrolledinyt.com. Thanks for watching.